other troopers and their commandos have been forced to surrender the bridge and fall back. Major Kandur is in custody. By 346 infantry divisions, he rushed to take over this sector under cover of night. As for the rest of our 21st Panzer, we do not seem to be done with British airborne troops. Before sunset yesterday, a second airborne wave landed by gliders in the 736 Grenadier Regiment sector. Combined with the major advance from the east, the 736 has disintegrated. The way to Caen is wide open to the Allies. Our orders are to move back on the western bank, taking with us any advanced elements from Oberst Oberst's battle group, and charge in the old way for so the Allies won't push forward. Our objective is to reach beyond the Cairn, thus driving a wedge between the British and Canadian interests. Then, we will be easy prey for our follow-up offensive, led by freshly arrived 1st SS Panzer. Beyond the mare, with only a few kilometers ahead, but to reach it, we will have to walk over another British airborne brigade. To do so, we will be supported by Storm Artillery's Kampfgruppe Tannenberg. The Royal Air Force dominates the sky and will give Allied ground troops all the support it can. The British paratroopers are aware they can't stop us, but time is place for them. All they need is to delay us long enough, for reinforcements will come to their rescue. If we don't get ahead of the paratroopers fast enough, we will be in danger of being outflanked. And so our mission is to reach beyond the mer with as many troops as possible to effectively cut the Allied defense in two. Those troops will be all we can count on until the 12th SS Panzer delivers its blow. We must reach this point. Heavy assault guns will be supporting us. Today we're going to find out how many Germans it takes across Colomb Belez. So, let's just get right into it. So, we need spa troopers, we need two, two, twos. Yeah, that'd be cool. Uh, Panagrands were kind of low in infantry now because we lost uh, Ostrupen, but hey, they're Ostrupen. Now we're going to have a lot of tanks. Yeah, that's a good point. Okay. Uh, that's actually probably be pretty useful in a phase of fire support. I'm not really a big fan on stews. I mean, not a bad unit. Just don't really find them too, too great. And yeah, yeah, just. If we can actually get the flat gun in, now that it'll be curated, that'll be pretty damn cool. Okay, Rhine Rafa. And airplanes. Uh, just some. I'd say just one card to fight would be enough, and I'm probably gonna need. Yeah, bomber to just bomb the crap out of everything as the guys move through. So we got to evacuate a lot of people. Now I'm really thinking the best way to do this is just to go across the canal here. It's pretty pretty simple. We can just use the river as our defense because there you could spend a lot of time trying to fully fight over that factory, but yeah, it will prove to be quite bloody in the long run because if you ever played multiplayer you know how not for pain that is to fight and win in the factory line so I'm thinking we just put an anti-tank gun over here for defense because they're also going to attack us on the flanks as we move up because you can't make it easy now can we 
Maybe there's a scroll of... Oh, it's just regular grenadiers and not panzer grenades. Alright, we're going to need all the tanks we can at the start to really break through. I'm pretty... I'm just concerned about getting over here. Uh, anti air gun. Trying to think, where could you go? That's good enough. Uh, infantry as well. Some grenadiers to try to push through here. Panda grenadier support. And two squads of panda grenadiers. I'm going to bring one tank over here. Uh, and a lot of fire support because... Oh, I didn't mean to start, but we're starting anyway. And fire support because we need fire support. And yeah, we're just going to try and break through. And our ally is ever so kind enough to give us a recon plane to start. It's going to be another 10 minutes till he comes in with his army. And we're up against three armies first two, so that's going to be fun. Now, these are only tret tetriarchs, so an auto cannon will kill him eventually. Just it's the eventually part. There we go, one down. And we're just going to keep rushing you guys up. Another run down. Or fall them back at least. There's a plane. Oh god, uh, sort of spotted yet. Oh god. Need a rush, need a rush. Okay, he's forced to retreat because of all of that stuff. And oh, geez, that's quite a bit over here. Uh, we're going to get an eight anti aircraft gun and start moving everyone into position because Jesus Christ, that is quite, quite a force. Our uh, infantry surrendered because we, we rushed them in. God, those Tetriarchs, they're in an annoying position as well. Because they got... Oh, there we go, another kill. Come on, don't, don't, don't see flank. And... Jesus, okay, we need to uh, just artillery all of that. This has a huge concentration of forces. Come on, kill, kill the little John, that's kind of the scary unit here. That's a lot of, Jesus Christ. That's like two platoons. Bit of a hiccup. Okay, I already, I already got the Rhine wrap and being brought up, so fire support, infant. Uh, actually, fire support down below would be pretty good too. I already got fire support as well. I would just get more. Okay, flight gun got destroyed, but it's not too big of an issue. Here you go, crew killed. And you're very low in ammunition, so... We're going to pull you back to the infantry front. And... Yeah, just, 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 just get out. Jesus Christ. That's so <laughs> many infantry units. Okay, rapid damage, that's perfect. And you just need to... C come on, keep on moving. Are you taking shots from that? 
Anti-aircraft gun. We're going to just get a plane next. I mean anti-aircraft gun. I mean anti-tank gun. Uh, yeah, we can't really afford to get infantry if we want to get a plane out. There we go. Yeah, this is that's a lot of infantry, man. And it sucks because our infantry aren't exactly amazing. I mean, we got half tracks, which is what makes us good. Okay, come on, fly over, spot that gun. There we go, he's repositioning. There we go. Oh god, he moved. Well, they're forced to fall back for now. Uh huh. There we go. Yeah, that Rhine or rocket artillery piece, whatever it's called, definitely helped out, yeah. And let's just rush you up. You're probably going to get killed, but... Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, come on, just kill it. The annoying thing is we don't get mortars. That's that's a real annoying thing. Because I don't know what I can really do to a kill out pack gun except for slowly moving up and using the plane. And we're, slow we're moving up. Maybe an AFA supply unit would have been a good idea. There you go, we're holding quite round on the left. Yeah, it's an uh, anti-tank gun. Okay, oh god, just... Oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Get the water, get the water! It's about to be hot. It's got very hot very quickly. God, it's at a raw of attrition. And we still got to break through and get to the other side. I mean, we're making pretty decent progress. It's just a six pounder bugging me still. And we're going to get more defenses on the left soon, eventually. Okay, here we go. Once I get spotted, now they're just getting rickety wrecked by the Panzer line. And this is funny, this is a German Panzer, you know, campaign. You know, and we're, we're using crappy French tanks still. You know, we don't have any of these crazy Tigers or whatnot. It's just rather outdated French tanks and fire support vehicles. You think like Company of Heroes, are, you know, they throw new Panzer IVs and Stugs, and then we're on mission to get the Tiger, and it's like, oh boy, the Tiger. And I'm doubting we're going to get even a King Tiger. Because we're the, the 25th. Damn, that's a sneaky position there, mate. As you can see, yeah. Six pounder is just in a nasty location. It's another six pounder. God damn it. I wish I had mortars. I really wish I had mortars. Because even a Rhine the not a Rhine Raffer, I keep calling it the Rhine Raffer. There goes a 2 2 3. I 
mean, I, I could get recon. I know some of you are probably sound at the screen right now. Just rank, get recon. Jesus Christ, it's not that hard. You're correct. You are correct. But I'm also just trying to attack against the clock here. It is an interesting mechanic, having to try to get the guys to survive. And maybe I should just bum rush them. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Really? Just, just kill it, just kill it. Okay, finally our six pounder's dead. Oh, thank God. There we go. Okay, run v run me. Colum Belez. Dogfight only. Are we gonna kill it? Oh, you're an idiot. You're evac. You don't evac a plane in a, in a flight like that, bruv. Okay, just... Ryan Ralph out entire area. Okay, now we actually got a bridgehead settled. There we go. Now we actually got to make sure that they get yeah. There we go. Okay, we're gonna get a pan uh, we need to set up defenses maybe so a pack gun would be good. I'm probably dropping off the recon here. And I guess run shit really hits Oh you motherfucker Sneaky recon leader Actually no we need we need this in our time of need. Pack gun got destroyed? Okay, it's a pack gun up here. Oh, he should do a decent job defending our left flank. And yeah, we just bypass the factory because we don't need the factory. Okay, that's a lot of infantry over here. Uh, let's try to get a Panzer four over. And probably our best bet is to buy it so they come over here and then go across. Right, I need to resupply you. Still got a small little corridor. Damn, what a mission this is. Because I'm, I'm struggling rather, do I keep units alive? Or do I keep units on the battlefield to keep reinforcing? Or do I just keep trying to rush guys over to the right? I'm thinking the best thing to do is just hold right here with everything you got, and then right at the end you just move everything. And now we're just going to do this at fast because there's nothing really too interesting going on when we're resupplying. I'm just really worried what this final mission is going to be. Yeah, MG42s all along the perimeter should prove quite fruitful.
Uh, grenadiers destroyed, whatever. Okay, we got nine units evacuated. I think it's not too much over here, but goddamn, I still have a feeling that uh, six pounders over here somewhere. Okay, uh, yeah, just Panzer fours are going to be very important, of course. Uh, yeah, support trucks. Oh god, outnumbered, outnumbered. Okay, anti-air now would be a good idea. And oh god, uh, I guess our best bet is more to run. Yeah, more to run. And okay, yeah, you're you're actually correct, yeah, bud. I agree with you. Okay, let's just secure you over here. We're gonna keep one Panzer four Yayo just for uh, defense. Okay, more reinforcements. That's good. That's very good. Uh, Panzer four over here. That's a lot of reinforcement, just good. Alright, okay, now we're in phase C. Okay, maybe... Uh, no, we still need to keep Ron Panzer four over here. That's important. Maybe we should just get you guys over. Machine gun team. I just like, what units do we need to get over here? I mean, okay, Panzer Grenadiers is going to be a smart choice, of course. Move the tanks over. Okay. I said I needed to get anti-air, but I haven't brought any anti-air. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, supply tracks. And do our allies units count if they manage to break through? That's a good question, actually. Anti-tank gun. Uh... SDKF, 2 2, whatever. Yeah, we've mostly secured it so far. We've still got the flanks going, going strong. Probably gonna, uh, yeah, I want to get the flat gun next. If we can get a flat gun into the last mission, it'd be the flat gun that survived the entire campaign. You know, he, he was popping guys at the initial beachhead, and he'd be popping guys again at the same beachhead. Okay, will you kill it? There we go. You killed it. Recon would have been good, but, uh, you know, make do with what you got. Uh, keep on moving. Keep on moving. Nothing to see. Nothing to see. Yeah, it's it's a good idea. Oh, just keeping a panic around here, yeah. You're correct. You are very correct. But keep on moving. Keep on moving. And now I guess you end up kind of getting surrounded. Uh, oh god, we need to get some artillery over. Artillery is going to be very important in the final battle. 
blow them up from far away with artillery. Uh, if we evacuate a recon unit without transport, does that do anything? Actually, you're just going to fast move over here. Uh, you are right, we should just disengage in GTFO. So, no, 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 bad. Yeah, there we go. Okay, Panther 4 still alive, that's cool. Uh, Anti-air, yeah, another SDKF. Damn, this is fun. I, I'm really liking this, having to break through. Okay, we got like another seven minutes. That's more than enough time. I mean, that initial breakthrough is hard, but they don't really reinforce. They're all just attacking over here. And, oh, you, you're you an idiot with your brumper. Absolute, absolute idiot. Mozzie, 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 Mozzie. Oh, God, he's trying to... Yeah, it's a mosquito. I can't show you yet. Need to get leader units over. That's important. Oh no! You got hit by the... Oh god. Do we, yeah, the supply truck be able to pick you up. You just have to hitch like a ride. A uh, panda grenadiers, you're gonna have to die in vain. Well, not entirely in vain, but still enough. We're not gonna be able to get much recon out. Panda grenades, you're just you you're to hold the factory for now. Get you four minutes. Where's that resupply truck? Yeah, it is. And I think our allies units count too. Here we go, some roughin' roughin' riffin' raffin'. Come on. Another Panzer IV. You know, the Panzer Grenadier, of course, as you see, very important. Just keep fast moving. Okay, we're getting a lot of units through. This is bang, bang, bang. And I don't think we're going to get anything else out in time. So let's just really speed us up and pray to God that they manage to get out. See them um, flanking us now, so. Yeah, two minutes. Yeah, this is going to be a last. We got most of it out. I'm kind of sad. We didn't, I think we got one or two uh, ground recon units out, which is good. And I think the Panda Grenadiers is going to be a little bit too slow on foot. And damn, that's, that's such a cool design for mission. You know, as we, as we break through a little spearhead and now we're like running as they chase behind us. Okay, is, can the Panther 4 make it towards the end? I guess they kind of just disappear in the hangar or something. Oh, it's going to be tight. It's a race against the clock. You don't want to be a DNF now, do you? Oh, it's going to be DNF. Oh, no. Oh, did he get out? I think he got out at the end. Okay, Panzer IV, and that was a Panzer IV indeed. Um, wasn't really about the kills here, of course. More just about breaking through. We got a lot of guys through. So, see you next time, where we finally kick the Tommies out of France.